Paul McCartney and John Lennon are among the most successful composers in American history. Together, as Lennon-McCartney, the name assigned to their biggest songs in the credits, they've achieved more wins on the Hot 100 than most songwriters can dream of, and many of their tunes were not simply quick blockbusters, but smashes with lasting impact. Despite the fact that they do not have a new song, the two are expected to return to Billboard's list of the most consumed songs in the United States in the coming days. Beyoncé's new album, Cowboy Carter, credits Lennon and McCartney as songwriters. The superstar covered the Beatles' Blackbird, and it's on track to become a minor hit on the charts in the coming days. Beyoncé improvised her version of Blackbird. Instead of being a single project, the composition is now a collaborative effort. Beyoncé praised fellow singers Britney Spencer, Raina Roberts, Tanner Adele, and Tira Kennedy on the track all of whom will score major hits in the near future. She also changed the name somewhat, so there are now two IS in the title, which is consistent with the formatting she's used for this collection. After Cowboy Carter has had a full tracking week, Beyonce's Blackbird is likely to make it to the Hot 100. The majority, if not all, of the songs on the full length will most certainly make the competitive cut, bringing Bay's career total number of positions up significantly, possibly by 20 or more. Despite its great popularity, the Beatles' song Blackbird never made it to the Hot 100. The chart was constructed differently in the late 1960s, with only significant singles making the cut. The song appeared on the band's self-titled album, also known as The White Album. It never earned its place on the Hot 100, as so many of the group's other songs have, but that could change soon. Lennon and McCartney scored a fresh Hot 100 smash as songwriters just last year. The Beatles returned with their first song in decades, Now and Then, which was a huge success. That song debuted inside the top 10, returning the Fab Four to the top tier on the chart. Because of its placement on the record, Blackbird has the potential to become one of Cowboy Carter's best performing songs. As fans stream the set in large numbers, they are more likely to play and replay the earlier tracks, whereas those later in the track list may not reach the same heights. There are several standouts on the project depending on how they fared on sites such as iTunes and Spotify. But with an album as large as Beyoncé's, the earlier the song debuts, the higher its chances of making it to the Hot 100.